So this is just a quick uh, Geomagic wrap tip that I came across the other day that I was reminded of because somebody was asking the question. In this instance, you look over here uh, in the tree and I have one polygon object and you see here it's just kind of a mess of objects together, but it's one object in the tree. And if you click here, just anywhere, and then you do like a select bounded components, you'll see that there's separate components in this component right but yet it's one object in the tree so if you ever want to break these apart automatically you can just come over to tools and you say new object from components and you can either cut and copy and then you hit ok and it'll just make every object that's in there its own object in the tree here so now if I just show only this, show only that, show only this. And that is a good uh, point to make here too, is if there are any floating little bits, pieces like this, that they will be their own object. So if you wanted to get rid of those ahead of time, you can run another tool that confuses people as well as this make manifold open, this right here. And it will remove small bits and pieces like that before you break it apart. Because if it if it was a really messy scan, then you will have thousands of these, right? So and then you if you broke it apart, you would say, I want to delete all these one at a time or shift select them. But um, that's just a general thing here. So now I have broken those two parts. Now, if I needed those to be back as one object together, I can select both of those. And instead of going to merge, because merge is like merging the scans together, it's trying to make one cohesive piece that uh, are supposed to be one object, right? Um, and a Boolean is like, if I want to take pieces and do a traditional like CAD Boolean where they need to be unified, if they're two solid spheres that they would be two solid spheres together or cutting one from another or vice versa. But then there's this other idea here of combine. So if I just say I want to combine and leave stitch off and hit apply, this takes me right back to where I was when we started. So you see now it's still two objects because if I swipe and do a bounded component, it's still its own bounded component. And then Yes, I could just come right back over here and say from cut and paste, and then now it's separate pieces. So just a little explanation. Uh, RAP has some terminology here that sometimes is unclear, and and some tools like this, they're um, a little hidden sometimes. And so a new object from components is how you would break apart a piece into its separate objects. So I hope this was helpful. This is your wrap tip for the day.